Okay, so what we're going to look at here is the European Fall Brood test kit. Same as the American Fall Brood test kit. So I'll take off that tag. Uh, this one's out of date, so who knows if we'll get even a good test or not. But rip off the side there. This goes in the uh, cells over here. Here's your uh, directions. Make sure you read them. They're in different languages. Make sure you read them. Make sure you know what you're doing. Don't rely on just this video. This is the actual test. You got your dauber and you got your uh, empty bag, of course, now. And then your uh, solution to shake it up into. So we're going to set that right there. Put our dauber right here. Make sure the tip is not getting to get uh, any other information on there. So uh, that tab, some of the, some are white, some are black, uh, who knows why. Uh, okay, so you find an infected cell that you think has European fall brood, or if it's an American fall brood, you find out, you know, same thing. Uh, turn it around in there, you scoop it out. Preferably you have, for, preferably you have this uh, cap off first. Get the cap off, put it in there. Push it around a little bit, tap it off, make sure it came off, find another one, and it's a lot easier if you knock the bees off the frame first, pull that out, stick it in there. If you got two or three cells that you can uh, get from, just knocking that off, there's a nice one. Push it around, put it in there. Again, make sure it comes off. There's nothing left on there. I go ahead and I put that in the bag. And then, oops, don't jump the gun. Put your cap back on here. And you start shaking it up. You keep shaking and shaking for a while. Keep shaking. In the meantime, you can go ahead and put this frame back in the hive. Keep shaking. Alright, so get your diver ready. You can put your bottle to the side, rip this off, and make sure you don't touch the uh, uh, spot that you're going to put the fluid in. So what I like to do is I put my fingers here and I just push up, making sure it's on the far side there. Usually they put it in that way, every once in a while they don't. As you can tell this one here is the, there we go, the European Fall Brew Test. And you want to make sure it's level, you can put it there. You open up your bottle. Let me turn that a little bit more so you all can see that. Let me see if I can zoom in a little bit. Put it right there. Zoom in some more. There we go. That way you guys can see the test kit. Or actually it, how the test comes out. I'm trying to get it there so you can, you can see it. All right. So now that's nice and close. All right, so put your dauber in there. Get a nice little solution full. You can kind of see it floating around in there a little bit. And then put two drops, maybe three. Right there in the middle. Take your dauber, put it back in. Squirt it back in there. And place the cap. And as you're waiting for this, Oop. Jiggled everything around. I start putting the stuff back in the bag and just dropping it in there. And now you can see it's starting to come across. This is the test line and then the control line. And we'll wait. And the control line usually shows up really well right away. 
test line takes a little bit longer sometimes on European. And it's still coming across. Wait that time, make sure it's still coming across. All right, so test negative for European. Ooh, there we go. So you have your test line here, and then you have your control line. So there's a T and a C. The C will always show up. Let me get it back down here so it focuses better. So you want the control line to show up. That shows that the test kit is still uh, good, the control line. The test line is, if it shows up, then you're positive for either European file brood or if you're using an American file brood test kit, which is identical to this one, it just says AFB on the back instead of EFB. And if you get any kind of line, then you are positive for uh, American or, like this one, European. So hopefully you enjoyed the video. Hopefully you uh, learned something from it. And I know for years I was always wondering what was in these little bags and what the test kit looked like. And then I got to start playing around with them. And then I didn't really want to see any positive results like the American Fall Brew. That was really bad. European's bad enough. But, all right. Have a great day. And thank you for watching.